Hey, what's up guys? How are you guys doing today? Hope everyone's having a great day as always. Dude, how cool was that Hurricane Disco Hypo Clown? Dude, I can't believe we have two of those bad boys over here at Always Evolving Pythons. Guys, as you guys could see, we have already changed up a lot of things over here. Well, not so much myself, but you know, Alan and my nephew Eli, which you guys are going to see here shortly. I know you guys saw him right now. You guys are probably, probably thinking, damn, is that easy? -E? No, it's not easy. -E. It's actually my nephew. But we'll get to him in a little bit. But yeah, guys, so a lot of these snakes were actually, you know, outgrowing their tubs. And Tina and I were actually here yesterday. And we were here for probably about like eight hours. But everything got moved here to uh, the, to the new uh, bins over here. As you guys can see, we have, uh, we have a spot nose, redhead, lace, clown. Cypress Fire Lace Clown. And it's actually not even fire, it's just Cypress Lace. And then we have some Lace Clowns here. What else do we have over here? Um, Cypress Leopard Clown Head DG. Already hidden back over there. Orange Dream Desert Ghost Double Hat Hypo Clown. This is one of my favorites right here. Black Pastel Orange Dream Hypo Desert Ghost Head Clown. What else do we have over here? Chocolate Hypo Desert Ghost, 100% Head Clown. Dude, we have some crazy stuff over here on this side. And dude, it's so cool is knowing that we have all these right here completely, completely uh, filled up. We have a couple of spaces left, but things are looking really good. So yesterday we had Clutch 21, which was a clown, just a regular clown bred to our Spot Nose Red Stripe Desert Ghost Genetic Stripe, 100% Head Clown. She had dropped eight eggs. That was his first a female that he ended up siring you know we always get a little nervous when these males start breeding with some of these females because you know they're kind of young you want to make sure they can sire the clutch but it went really really good um eight eggs one slug all of them have really really healthy veins we actually pulled that out we weren't able to get on camera but this one right here is a powerhouse of a clutch the only thing that sucks is she only left us five eggs same scenario with uh, a first with the male that you know first time siring this female I wish I would have. I wish it would have laid a couple days later when the Trident Clutch would have all shut out. Because right now they're in deep, deep shed. But look at this, guys. Right here we have a Trident female. This is the Trident female that I ended up getting on the um, with Chase when they had the auction, and I ended up winning this snake. And she was bred to our Stranger Pompeii. So hopefully we get lucky and we hit some Stranger Trident. I mean, just all that craziness. But guys, I'm super, super excited. And also, we're about to cut a clutch right now, which is so funny because yesterday when moving some snakes, I told Tina, hey, you know this snake here was, you know, um, hatched last year around the same time. And you can see the difference of how much she's grown within the year. All right, guys, so let me introduce my other nephew here. How about you shut the water so you stop wasting them, big dog? Yeah, man, that's what you stop wasting water with no problem. But this right here is my nephew, Eli. Um, you know, he's actually here working with us as well, alongside my other nephew, Alan. That Alan's just been killing it, but Eli, how wow. do you like this so far? I'm a little new, but I like it. It's better. It's yeah, one of the best jobs was, I got. This mystery talked like a freaking gangster. Yeah. Oh, it was crack. Nah, it was. I don't even tell him about like the that. big bat snakes. That's Man, you're really <laughs> not playing, but, but yeah, yeah. Uh, dude, it's so funny. Eli, when he it was little. That he gave me this opportunity, you know, I appreciate it a lot. When he was little, he was the, I think he was like afraid of me. You didn't, didn't like me when you were a baby, huh? Nah, yeah. <laughs> It was weird. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but now, man, I'm glad to have him here. You know, it's, it's pretty cool having both of my nephews here. But uh, you're enjoying it so far, everything? Uh, yeah. Have you been bit? A lot of times. Man, does it hurt anything? No? It's like a little scary. Like, it's yeah. a little nip, you know? Hell yeah. Man, yeah, it's pretty well, cool. Well, thank like you for everything, um, little Easy e a.k.a. Awa Pipa. You're the man. Let's <laughs> go. Right. And guys, just to guess, see, I'm not lying. The um, tridents are, like, deep in shit. Look at this. But by next vlog... We'll have these things out, man, and dude, we'll be, some of them are going to be up for sale. They'll be going up on my Patreon first. But yeah, let's uh, cut this clutch here. It's actually pretty cool that, you know, we had the same pairing. Just the only thing was last year, she went a little later than uh, than this year. So it was, you know, obviously I've been going super, super late. Actually, I went, she went late this later this year. But let me see. So the pairing was Black Pastel Hypo Clown Head Desert Ghost to a Yellow Belly Desert Ghost Head Cryptic. And that's where we ended up hatching this girl right there. So this is from the same clutch, same pairing last year. How freaking cool is that right there? And she's about like 700, 800 grams. All right. Alan, do you have any paper towels you could bring me, Big Dog? And as you can see, we have some pippin already. 
Oops. All right, so what we're wanting here are obviously some visual desert ghost combos. So let's see, let's start off with this one right here. If not, everything will be triple hat. All right, so right here, I could just tell right off the bat that it's a uh, yellow belly. It could be yellow belly desert ghost. So I lied, I can't tell you right off the bat. I have problems with the desert ghost still, you know, when um, they're still in the egg. I have to wait till they come out and shed. Sometimes I feel like if it's desert ghost, but then it's totally not. This is a black pastel desert ghost. Just because we always see how regular black pastels look, I'm 100% positive that's a desert ghost. Ooh. This is, so I've actually made this already. This right here is a Krypton desert ghost. So that right there would be a desert ghost. Krypton, which is double, which would be pretty much Het Clown, Het um, Cryptic, and Het Hypo. That's a cool snake right there. Actually hatched the exact same thing. This right here, but this is a Black Pastel Desert Ghost Krypton. So that would be the same snake, but without um, the Black Pastel, that's just Krypton. But it is a Desert Ghost. That's a cool snake right there. Right here, kind of looks like this one as well too. I'm not too sure. I know it's probably just. Uh, I don't even know why I said yellow. Uh, it's probably, that one's probably yellow belly. Sorry, that's what it is. So it's broken down like that. Oh man, this one popped up. Look at this. Here's a desert ghost Krypton. Another one as well. You could tell right by the banded eyes like that too. Such a cool snake. So basically, they're pretty much like quad hats well no triple official yeah guys it's been a long weekend <laughs> <laughs> super long all right so remember i was telling you like this right here will be a regular black pastel and you can see how prettier the desert ghost black pastel so this is a black pastel triple hat so we'll put this over here nice so this right here is a Basically, this is this right there. The same the same snake we have right there. This is a Krypton. As you can tell, it has the patterns a lot busier than this one, just like the Kryptons do, and it is Desert Ghost. So we have four Desert Ghosts so far. And let's see this last snake here real quick. Let's get another DG. And this right here is a Krypton. Oh, another one. Just like these two. Look how pretty these are. It's just you can tell that Desert Ghost has like that creamish color, man. So let's go through these one more time. All right, so we have a Desert Ghost Crypt, um, yeah, Krypton Hit Hypo. And then we have a Black Pastel of Desert Ghost Krypton Hit Hypo. Desert Ghost Krypton Hit Hypo. Desert Ghost Krypton Hit Hypo. Black Pastel Desert Ghost, Hat Hypo. I believe this is a Yellow Belly Triple Hat. Yellow Belly Triple Hat. And a Black Pastel Triple Hat. But from the looks of it, we didn't hit no um, normals. That's pretty cool. Um, guys, as always, you know, we appreciate all of support. We're staying steady on these vlogs. We're not going to be missing any of them unless I have to like leave again for a couple of weeks and hopefully Tina can take over. But as always, guys, we appreciate all of support. Till next time. Peace. <laughs>